Hello all you mothers, brothers, sisters, and others, it's Yibo, and we is back here playing some more SLRR. Um, also, I finally downloaded some more music, um, big, 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 big shout out to, to Lakey Inspired, man makes nothing but fire beats, nothing but gas packs, it's just good stuff all around, give him eight follows and make sure you listen to every single song he creates guy is a legend um why are my seats floating you know i don't like my floating seats but i think right now what i'm gonna do is some races of the night Ugh, excuse me so let's skip ahead to 10 30 um, and we are gonna want some more power, so let's actually get this adjusted to where it needs to be, so this is like negative eight, negative eight, and then 12.5, there we go, 185 horsepowers, let's take this thing out on the streets, see what it does and yeah oh yeah here we are one of my favorite racing locations just because it's kind of rare let's see also i'm realizing that ooh let's see can we race for the pinks no what if i like go out and do it again no but I can race for $14,325, $23, excuse me, don't know numbers. Um, but yeah, I realize that this Einwagen is pretty, in pretty bad condition, at least engine-wise. So let's see, I don't know how long we'll make it, but hopefully we don't lose any races. Because losing races is a disgraces. And I don't want to lose my places on the leaderboards. Yep, yeah, that's all I got. So our prestige is at 239. Pretty soon here we're going to stop making you prestige, I think. Um, but I guess I guess we'll see when that is. Have to take the axis out and do some pursuits from the police. Um, I gotta remember, so... Number 10 is the car that we want to race pink slips against, so we'll keep that in mind. Um, and then, since this Einwagen is technically going to be our E-Cup race car, we should probably... I'm curious what I can bet. Eight grand? That's junk. And this guy's got a car that's fast as heck. Um, huh, what to do here, because... I'm not exactly sure if we'd win against this guy. Plus, it's kind of a crappy bet. What What is his prestige at? 118 and 455. So these guys have super high prestige for their cars. Um, so I think we should go back to the garage and then figure out what we're gonna use as our drag car. Whoops, driving in the driving in the grass. And then we should probably start to build. Um, okay. Yeah, but we'll let's find a car and build it. Alright, so we're back at the garage. And first of all, let's uh what's this thing at? 43%, so we should probably get a rebuild going on this guy. Um let's bring this thing over to the lift. Let's drop her down. Pull that. Oh, I guess pulling the hood off. Let's pull this swap out, and let's let's give it a good refreshing. Oh, that's nice. It only took like 800 bucks. 
so now let's see we're making 202 horsepower that's not bad but that's not class E either so the question is do we keep this as a E cup or E class car or do we throw more power at this thing and make it a faster car um, let's see this thing is you know it's in pretty good shape otherwise so I think maybe we should um, maybe we should well for sure we should go do another race and get some more money uh, also I like how I just said that I like this race location because it's so rare and now of course it's uh, showing up all the time so let's see so now I can bet a little bit more with that guy what about this yeah that guy can only bet like 10,000 so let's bet some monies against ya boy again Joe BZ let's let's start in second because I think we're gonna launch pretty crazy and we don't have very good tires Three, two, one, go! Ooh, look at that launch yeah, launching in second gear in this thing is usually pretty good if it's front wheel drive. Um, with top wheel drive, first gear works great, but yeah. Dang, dude, I got some skill doing that race with the hood popped. Insanity. Insanity. So now we got 15,000 more dollars. Let's head back to the garage and let's decide whether we're going to build this thing or whether we're going to build a new car. Alright, so first of all, let's get that hood closed. And second of all, let's let's see here. I think the first thing I'm gonna need to do is go to 7 a.m. and just take a look at the dealership, see what they've got in stock. So we've got one of these. You know, I've never actually like built one of these in this game. So it would kind of make it interesting to build one of these. The only thing that I don't like is that it's inline four. To be honest, I don't really like building these engines. Um, here's another Einwagen. That could that could be a solution. I don't really want to use one of these. And that's another one. What is with this? Like, there's so many of the cars that are just the same, same thing over and over. Does this thing have an engine though? I've never actually used one of these I definitely would not want to <coughs> excuse me uh, use a convertible though I think you can get like a hard top for it but I think the best idea is gonna be to to skip ahead another day and just see what we can find uh, so let's see what the, the new dealership has we got one of the fancy DLC Einwagens we've got another Axis um, another fancy Einwagen. We still got this, uh, Street GT. I wouldn't have any money to make it fast, though, and we still got this. I don't get why the dealerships aren't updated. Let's just see if we skip ahead to 7 or 8 in the morning. Let's see if there's, like, new inventory. Okay, I guess it's gonna crash. Alright, so we're back. Um, so I'm gonna have to go into the dealership once and then we'll go through and look at everything it's just gonna be the same garbage that we already saw and then let's skip ahead a day again and see if this will work now so let's see so far so good nice and we have different vehicles perfect Ooh, ooh! I wish I had a little bit more money because I would definitely like to, to cruise the streets in this thing. Let's see—is it manual? It is manual. Hmm. Then we got. So basically, I need to choose between whether I want to use this car. I've never actually used this car in the game before, or if I want to use the the Prime. Isn't the Prime kind of a rare car? I have a feeling that this is like a rare car and uh, I should buy this. 
Hmm, I think, you know what? We have that Einwagen piece of poop, right? Don't we? Yes, we do. Let's go ahead and go to the car dealership. Make sure that... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that really sucks. Well, I guess we're using this. Um, shoot. Okay. Well, yep. This is gonna be our, our big horsepower green slip car. So, I think what I'm gonna do is start stripping this thing down and we're gonna fully build this thing. Um, so without further ado, fast time. So you're probably wondering, what the hell, why is this thing half torn apart already? Well, it's because I'm having issues taking it apart, and I was recording to make, like, the the sped up version, you know, make it with music and junk, and I cannot find this spring. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just take this thing all apart, and then it's gonna be a jump cut to when this thing has no suspension. Alright, so here we are, got all the suspension out of this thing. It was actually pretty easy to get it all once I hid the body. Um, but let's get the engine out of this thing. Let's see, pull the bumper off. Get that out of there, and there we go. We got a nice, clean, bare <laughs> shell to build off of. Um, let's let's start purchasing some things. So, running gear, I'm going to want... Hmm, probably the... The Super Turismo, that's what it is, right? Yeah. So we'll do that, because we want some nice, beefy suspension. The shocks, we're going to do the... Uh, I mean, for springs, we're going to do the 6.5-inch springs, just because they will get dirt nasty low. Uh, let's see, where is the... Well, here's the bar. Um... So, there's one. I'm assuming the other one is here. Yeah. And where is the struts for this thing? Here we go. So... Holy crap, that's uh, expensive. There should be two more. Um, Somewhere. Somewhere. There we go. And let's do brakes. We're going to need some big boy brakes. Um, so, we're probably going to do like the the hauler I think it is has some big brakes yeah here we go so there's 265 so we'll do 365 in the front and 345 in the back and we're running out of money really quick uh, wheels I have those wheels we'll see if those will fit decent let's get all that stuff on here So there we be. Um, it does look a little goofy with the 10 inch, 10 inch wide wheels. Maybe we'll we'll fix that. Put some wider wheels on there. Um, but for now, I think it'll be okay. And let's see, where did that engine go? Where did the engine go? Oh, here it is. Um, so I know that Ishima engines are kind of jank, but let's see what we can salvage from it. Um, the arrow pipe we can keep, this we can keep, Let's see what alternator is this, we'll keep the alternator, ooh, that transmission we actually do want to keep, and is it an all wheel drive transmission, let's actually just hide this, it is an all wheel drive transmission, so that is actually perfect, so that'll save us some money, let's get that rebuilt. Um, the, whoops, the clutch and flywheel, we will get, Jesus Christ, get rid of, those are gonna be junk to us, um, the turn one manifold we'll get rid of, that's gonna be junk to us as well, and then pretty much the rest of this build, minus the oil pan, actually even the oil pan probably, cause that's pretty, pretty junky. 
and even if we get a new one, it's going to be not as good. So let's get rid of that, and now let's build ourselves a new engine. Okay guys, so I've been doing a little bit of tuning here, um, just off camera, been tuning the engine and we got a nice 644 horsepower um, and as you can see there's some camber here, uh, so I'll actually show you how I did that. So on SLR 2.3.1 you can do move parts and then I just clicked on the wheel, whoops, like this and then I just basically did this. And I just wanted it to be flush. Also, I changed the wheels to the the Baron DTM wheels. They look pretty nice. And put a huge ass can on there. Um, so now we just need some paint. Let's see. This car, I'm I'm going for like a royal blue. So we we can't have any any red or anything in there. It's just what the hell. It's gotta be just blue. So let's get this bad boy painted, that nice Subaru blue. Dang, check that out guys, check that out, that is looking real nice. Um, I might want to move the engine up a, a hair though, that, that looks like it's kind of low. So let's see, does this move, no it doesn't, what if I move the block? There we go, that's what I'm looking for. Uh, let's move this up, I don't know, like that much. Let's see what that looks like. Yeah, that looks better. It looks a lot better. I'll take that. Um, so yeah, we got a nice nice stance here. Let's see how this thing does. Um, actually, I gotta reconnect my controller. Let's see if this will even work. Uh, there we go, yep. So let's take this on the, the test track and let's see how it does. Oh, wait a second. Look at the wheels, they're going all goofy. Oh wait, is this thing automatic? Oh, it is. Well, that is good to know. I think, yeah, this thing hauls. Uh, let's return to garage, and I'm gonna fix those wheels. That's uh, that's goofy. Let's reset that, and let's reset that. Wait, reset that, and yeah. So I guess you're not gonna wanna add camera to your SLR ride, um, because I did try moving the uh, control arm, maybe we need to, well, let's see here. So if we adjust this, it just adjusts that. What about the spring? Doesn't do anything. What about the shock? Doesn't do anything. What about... Yeah, I guess it's just you can't really can't really do it. Um, whoops, why the hell did I do that? But look at the time; it's a perfect 10:07. We've got a lot more prestige now on our car, so let's take this thing out and let's just tear up some night races. 
Holy shit, guys. So I was just driving this thing to the, the race, and this thing handles so well. I can't believe I've never... Yes! Yes! Oh, pink slips! Oh, yeah. Um, but I can't believe I've never used one of these cars. This is just great. It handles so well. Three, two, one, go! Let's see what it runs for a quarter mile time. I'm guessing that's like a 10 or 11, maybe. That wasn't that fast, but it'll get us through the, the green slip, I think. You win the race! Yeah, 10.6. So, nice. We got that pink slip that we wanted. Let's go and see. I'm very curious to see whether this will win against uh, some of these other guys. Like the... The Coop Sport, I think, is next. Let's see. So let's just bet all of our money. Hopefully, we can win against this guy. I'm, I'm very confident we can, but, you know, just in case. Just in case. Three, two, one, go! Yeah, boy! Pulling ahead. Yeah, I'm definitely glad I chose to build a new car. It's very exciting to see this thing work so well. Oh, please don't hit me. Please don't hit me. Thank God. I thought he was for sure hitting me. You win the race! Nice. Um, let's head back to the garage again. Um, just because I want to... Well, actually... Should I go back to the... Let's do, let's do one more race. Actually, wait, no, no, no. The whole reason I want to go back to the garage is to get nitrous, because this next guy is going to be impossible to beat, even with nitrous, probably. So, let's see here. Um, line four, performance systems... Let's do the nitrous. Actually, I think our our drift car has nitrous, and that's not gonna need it. So let's take it off there. Dang, check that out. Oh, actually, you know, I don't think we'll be able to use that because that's not the Remo GTI. That might be an issue. Um, hmm. Let's see here. Oh, I don't have nitrous on here. What the hell do I have nitrous on? Oh yeah, the Iron Dragon. Duh. Let's take the nitrous off of here. We probably won't need it. Honestly, I'm thinking about it. I don't really know if we'll need this car really because what are we gonna need an E-Class car for? I guess we'll keep it around just in case. But yeah, what, what are we gonna need it for? Unless we just do some sweet builds. There we go. Let's get that nitrous tuned yeah 100 pounds an hour should be good um let's head back out and see how it does again oh nice dang this thing is just so quick and watch how it corners it's just beautiful I mean, look at this look at this you can go fast as hell Dang, check this out. Check this. Oh, hey, we're here. Nice. So let's participate. Oh, no, this is the guy. This is the guy that is just a pain. Well, I guess let's see. I'm going to use nitrous the entire time because this car, for some stupid reason, is just so fast. Oh, what? Okay, I guess he doesn't really know how to keep it on the on the road. So, what I need to do is I need to just race this guy over and over and over again. And I'm not going to stop until I either can't race him anymore or I get that pink slip. So, this will be my third time trying to race him again. 
Um, I might not be able to race him again because for some reason that person is not showing up on the race. But if he doesn't, that's okay. Ready for this? Boom! More pink slips. And this is exactly why you get super high prestige in the beginning of the game. Because normally, if you were to just go and do night races, you would never get <laughs> any of these pink slips. So, yeah. I think I'm actually going to name this video, like, how to get mad pink slips without cheats. And, yeah. No, I probably won't. I might make a separate video explaining it, though. Because this is wicked. Like, seriously. You win the race! Let's just do a little demonstration on how well this car handles. This is all without using the handbrake. No handbrake at all. This thing is just wicked. Like, I've seriously never enjoyed driving a car in SLRR so much. Dang, this thing is just nuts. Wow. Wow. This thing just blows my mind. Alright, let's do one more race and then I think I'll end the video probably. So let's see. Haulers. This is the guy that I that I wanted to what? That's kinda jank. That's also jank. Um I think we're just gonna head back to the garage because I wanted to race that one for pink sets. Actually let's see, is that a GTI? Or is that just a Remo? Oh, so it's just a regular Remo. Eh. Let's just head back. So before I end this video, I just want to show something here. We have got a lot of cars. So we've got our Ishima Anula WRZ with the Shimu Shibu engine. Um, then we've got our Doohan Ninja. You know, we got Pink Slip, Pink Slip. And then we've got our Einwagen. Um, this will probably still turn into like a, a cup racer or something like that. Uh, we've got our Doohan Axis that started it all, our, you know, drift missile, crazy automobile. And then we've got this piece of junk that should be smashed, but trust me, I have, I have good plans for that. Um, but, but yeah, I think that's where I'm going to call this video. I have to say this video has been pretty successful. We've got, you know, pink slips up the wazoo. We got a new car that is just absolutely insane to drive um you know it's not the the fastest vehicle i've ever driven in this game but it just handles so well um i have to say i'm i'm pretty impressed that i have never owned one of these before but i'm gonna stop rambling on thank you for watching and i will see you in the next one